Hello, my name is Johnny. Welcome to another Marvel Character Talk. Uh, today we're going to look at some Silver Age comics, recent pickups. If you'd like, please subscribe, hit that notification bell, like, reply, and share. Got some X-Men, Captain America, Iron Man, Hulk, and Avengers. All Silver Age 1960s. Let's look here. This is kind of a key issue. 52. This is the when the Black Panther joins. A lot of these I have either duplicates now or uh, some I sent in for CGC, so they're in cases, so I can't open them, so I wanted some more, and a couple, I think these two I didn't have at all. Let's take a look here, very cool. Cover corner, Hercules, Scarlet Witch, and Quicksilver were gone by this point, so they were down to just three Avengers, so it's good that uh, Black Panther was going to join. That's 52. Here's jumping way up to 78. You can see it's a 12 center. Uh, two Avengers down and four to go. This is Day of the Man-Ape. Very cool color bar. I like that red where it fades into orange and yellow. And by this time... Uh, Hawkeye had changed to uh, Goliath, and uh, Hank Pym and the Wasp were gone, and Quicksilver and Scarlet Witch were back. Uh, Vision had joined, and of course here Black Panther and Cap's just visiting. Look how cool the coloring is on uh, the man ape there. This one's a neat cover, the Super Adaptoid, number 45. Hercules was around, Cap was there. And this one, Goliath, had just come back, and they hadn't added the Wasp to the cover corner yet. This, this episode or issue wasn't that exciting but uh, I, I like the team let's take a look at this one the 15 center a nightmare comes true Bruce Banner at the mercy of the Hulk stop Hulk stop don't you dare you're me this is the end Banner your end if I kill you I die there's a Herb Trimp or Trimpy cover that one, the scientists can separate him for a while. And there was two beings. And then I'm sure they went back very shortly. This one was kind of an odd one. He goes to the future. It's an early one. 1968, issue number five of... Uh, well, they always look better in the bag than they are. There's a lot of flaws on these. This one's real nice first glance I always kept thinking that that was uh, Kazar for some, some reason it's not because Kazar doesn't wear shorts like that anyway real, real nice 106 the cap just took over and what was the issue 100 from that and you can see the date stamp on there kind of blurry and a great looking Jack Kirby art and, and the perspective of it Five. There's Batrock. This is an early Batrock brigade. It's Jack Kirby. And you got uh, Swordsman and the Living Laser. I think he's supposed to be green. Sometimes on covers they do things differently. This one was neat. The Red Skull and these Exiles. Issue 104. Each had sort of a gimmick. Look at this guy in the chair. And this guy had the sheet and the Fez, the big giant guy. Cool. And then this one, uh, I haven't reread it. And some of these I got as a lot, so uh, some things were thrown in. I didn't have this one. Not too excited about it, except it's kind of neat because it does have there's Dum Dum Dugan. I believe that's Sharon Carter, not Peggy Carter, but Sharon Carter. And uh, Nick Fury from S.H.I.E.L.D. And then we've got some nice... Uh, that one's uh, Neil Adams, 
I mean, excuse me, issue 57 of 12 Center, Sentinels, Sentinels Live. At first, you just I just see that, and then this, and then you got to look close. That I believe that's Bolivar Trask, or one of the Trasks there. That's when they had the different color outfits. And that's when, at uh, this time period, uh, Professor X was dead from issue 42 to uh, 65 when he came back. This one is Barry Smith, I believe. This is the first Barry Smith, or Barry Windsor Smith, as he later was. And it's got Blastar, the living bomb burst. When you can't tell right there, but when he draws the Iceman, he's got a funny round head. I mean, elongated, rounded head. All right. Let's issue that one, and then this one. I like the cover here, 44, Red Raven, Red Raven. They're having sort of a special ones where they had the X-Men small and featuring uh, different members of the group separately after Professor X died. And then you can see by 53, they had gone back, even earlier, they'd gone back to the regular, and they changed the... The logo to more what we see on these forty dollars i didn't pay that i don't think uh, usually sometimes prices and it was a lot less most of these were weren't too expensive all right let's take one quick overview and thank you for watching this look through some silver age pickups here and doing this video at the end of june uh, 2024 until next time, another Marvel character talk. Thanks for watching, everyone.